Hello, YouTube family. Uh, good evening, good evening. This is Dr. Carmen Bryant. Welcome to my YouTube channel. I just wanted you guys to know that I will not be on this evening. Uh, I've had a, a late night. I'm, I'm coming in, um, and so I'm tired. And so I know a lot of you guys are like, go to sleep, Dr. C. So I'm going to take your advice. I'm going to go to sleep. But I just want to come on. You know, I always promise you guys that if I do not come on live, that I will let you guys know. I know some of you guys are waiting for me to come on. I apologize. Uh, but I am, I'm kind of tired. I just walked in. And so, you know, if, if I'm really, really tired, I really can't see even through those glasses. It just makes it kind of hard because I'm sleepy. And I want you guys to have my undivided attention whenever I'm coming on to talk to you guys. I want you guys to be encouraged because a lot of you guys are just coming out of the situation. And so it's really hard. Some of you guys are going back and forth trying to figure out whether to stay, go, stay, go, stay, go. Some of you guys are in the relationship trying to figure out how am I going to get out of this is there a light at the end of the tunnel? Is this possible? Some of you guys are in the fresh fresh discard. You know, they've left you and you can't figure out what you've done wrong. Well, you haven't done anything wrong. You were dealing with an individual that had an NPD, narcissistic personality disorder. Um, and, you know, you run through my videos, you know, whatever order you want to run through the videos and build yourself up. Build yourself up. Get you a good support system. Get you some legal advice. Get you a domestic violence advocate. Excuse me. I just ate too. Uh, but build yourself up. Uh, go to my mentors page, Helen Sadler, Destiny Helper. You know, uh, for the spiritual, biblical aspect of it, for those of you guys that are believers and, and uh, want a Christian perspective from it, those of you that are not believers, take the principles out of what's being taught to you. You know, take the principles out and apply it to you, whatever your spiritual belief system is, and apply it into your belief system. Uh, you know, uh, many of you guys are, have, have told me, you know, this is the worst pain I've ever been in in my whole life. Uh, is it possible that, that it ever, will it ever change? Or some of you saying that you're living with the shame of being in a relationship like that. Yeah, that is that is a major, um, major situation within a narcissistic relationship. When we come out, a lot of us do live with the shame. How did I get caught up in this? How in the world, you know, I'm an intelligent, I'm educated, you know, I have... It doesn't matter what you have or what you don't have. People fall prey to these type of individuals. And so you won't live with shame all your life, trust me, and stop beating yourself up. We didn't know because they didn't come with a sign or a, a, a block of instruction that says, I'm a narcissist. I'm going to ghost you. I'm going to harass you. I'm going to trauma bond you. I'm going to uh, gaslight you. I'm going to make you feel crazy. I'm going to harass your kids. I'm going to abuse the kids. I'm going to abuse you. You know, that's all I want is feel. I'm never going to love you. I can't. I'm, it's impossible for me to love you. I don't have compassion. I don't have empathy. Now, if somebody came with a block of instruction like that, I don't think we would have chose someone like that. You were manipulated into the relationship. And so you were manipulated into a relationship that was never real. So they were never honest with you. And so you fell in love with the imagery in your head. You fell in love with the mirroring that they did in order to pull you. So it was never a real relationship in the first place. And I have videos on that as well. And so don't beat yourself up by the mistakes that you've made because we've all made mistakes. All of us have made mistakes. And the majority of the people that are on YouTube, you know, or are a part of this tribe, all of us have made the same mistake. And the mistake was, is we didn't know any better. We weren't educated and we fell for the okie doke. How the, the kids say we fell for the okie doke. We were bamboozled. We were tricked, you know, but had we have this information now that you have this information, you can make more informed decisions, wiser decisions as of the relationships that you get into. Now you are armed. You have more arsenal and more knowledge now to choose wisely. Now, some of you uh, who are trying to come out of a relationship and jump right back into a relationship, you may jump right back in a relationship with a narcissist. So be prepared for that, you know, and hopefully it won't damage you. Some of you that are smart enough to wait, let me wait and take care of myself. Let me heal. Let me get counsel. Let me find out what's going on within me that, that where there's a lot, where there are holes at, where there's pain, where I'm desperate and I want a relationship. Or some of you are like, I want a relationship, but I'm willing to wait. Some of you just need to wait. Some of you need to, you know, some of us never really grew up. If you really think about it, no, some of us really never grew up. We never got to date ourselves. We never got to find out what we like, where we like to go. You know, if you treat yourself, you know, and I was just having this conversation with someone, if you treat yourself and take yourself to nice restaurants, male and females alike, if you take yourself to nice restaurants, take yourself to places, you know, maybe once a month or whenever you can afford a, a fancy restaurant where you can dress up by yourself and have your car valet, valeted, valet, valeted, there we go, valeted, valeted, 
uh, and, and go somewhere nice. Can't go in there talking like that either, you guys. Then you go somewhere nice, treat yourself to nice things. To, you know, rent a expensive hotel room, maybe for a night. You know, go somewhere and look at water or, you know, somewhere that's really nice and expensive. You know, it makes it a little harder for a person to say, girl, girl, I'm going to take you out for McDonald's. We can share a Happy Meal. Okay, but you've already, you've already introduced yourself to a finer lifestyle. And for you gentlemen, you know, stop trying to buy women. Stop trying to do everything for them. Don't give them, uh, you know, husband privileges. We always say don't give them wifey privileges if he's not going to put a ring on it. Well, men, you too. You know, don't be giving them husband privileges and she's not your wife. Put a ring on it. You know, and if you know that's not the one for you, you just if you feel that if she's pressuring you into getting married or make you feel guilty about not marrying you, maybe that's not it. If a woman's got to pressure you, maybe that's not it. Because a narcissist, a female as a narcissist will pressure you and then play on your emotions. If a woman is playing on your emotions to try to manipulate you into getting married, don't you do that. Don't you do it. Don't jump into something that you don't feel comfortable with and you don't feel, you know, like, okay, this is it and I know it. No, if you don't feel sure about it, don't jump into it. And that's male and females alike. And so hopefully you guys will forgive me for not coming on live tonight. Uh, I did do some clips from the fair. Some of you were asking if I go back and post the fair clip. Remember, I told you guys, if you are YouTube subscribers, uh, not on Facebook, I mean on YouTube, if you're YouTube subscribers, sometimes I do come on live and take you places. And sometimes it's just for the people that happen to be on live at that time. And then I delete the video. Now, yesterday, it just so happened that I was, it was just a bad connection where I was at. And so it kind of froze and I just deleted the whole video. So that was on me yesterday. Um, but sometimes I come on live and then I delete the video. This is just for the people that are there, you know, and sometimes a lot of you have told me you don't go anywhere. You don't do anything. You haven't got the energy to do anything. So you kind of live through the video. You know, you still got to go do something for yourself. That's why sometimes I come on live and I want you to go places with me as well to get yourself back. You know, some of you like, I can't do anything. So I just like to watch you do things, you know, well, you're doing it with me, you know, and for those of you, you try it, you do it. You go out there and do some things for yourself, okay? Take care of yourself. There's only one you, and you take care of yourself. You're valuable. You are the most precious investment there is. Invest in yourself. Invest in your children. Spend time with them. It takes time to recover. Stop trying to rush it. It, it Five, six years plus for me, you know, every day is a new day for me, remember? And remember, just like some of you, I have offsprings with the narcissists, the narcissists. And there's one, you know, that I was uh, married to that I have to deal with on a constant basis. And so I, just like you guys, have to practice what I preach. So I have to walk the walk just like I, I talk it, I'm going to walk it, you know. And whatever my mentor tells me and whatever I tell you guys, same thing that I have to live and do. So trust me, I'm not a hypocrite. I'm telling you guys, and I know it takes a while to recover from something like this. But just like I always tell you guys, and to my foreign uh, brothers and sisters on there, when you lick a window and you don't care anymore, you know that you're moving beyond where you're at. When I say lick a window, that means they do dramatic things to try to get reaction from you. And so if they lick a window and you're, oh my gosh, you're nasty. They were wanting a reaction from you. When they lick a window and you turn around and continue to have a conversation, you know that you've gotten beyond that individual. They're going to do anything they can for reaction. Remember that? So trust me, it takes time to heal. Stop rushing the process. Enjoy every day. Every day is a new day. Just like people that have been addicted to drugs and alcohol. Every day is a new day. And every, a lot of you guys are counting 22 days in the military, 22 days in the wake up. You know, a lot of you guys like 22 days, no contact, 60 days, no contact, one year, no contact. You know, um, some of you guys haven't gotten there yet. So I'm very proud of you guys. Do know that I'm one of your biggest fans and I'm here to support you guys. And those of you that have been asking me questions, I think some of you guys, <laughs> I think someone wanted me to call them. They had a lot of questions to ask me and wanted some clarification. Well, that comes at a cost. You have to make an appointment with me, um, and it is a paid service. So if you want a paid service, you know, an appointment, you want to ask me a bunch of questions, then I'm willing. You pay me, and you can ask me whatever you want to ask me. Just don't ask my age and my weight and my address. That's it. You know, so, but thank you guys so much. Make sure you um, hit the subscribe button on the YouTube. It's Dr. Carmen Bryant, Overcoming Narcissist Abuse. I do have Facebook, which is Psychological Health Consultants and Services. And I also have 
um, the other Facebook, which is Overcoming Narcissist Abuse. Hit those, uh, uh, the, the thumbs up. Also, I just uploaded my second episode in Podbean. You can find it in Podbean. You can find it on Spotify. And you can also find it on iTunes. Uh, so my second episode, as you guys know, I'm trying to build the foundation again. So the first episode was the interview with my, my dear friend, uh, Mr. Brian Corbett from KISS FM 104.7. Uh, and I basically just kind of gave a brief overview of what narcissist abuse is, what it looks like. And then in episode two, what I'm trying to do is I'm trying to build it up. I'm trying to show you what narcissistic personality disorder. So you guys have an understanding of what that is. Then I want to classify the narcissist, you know, and we'll build from there so that you get a basic knowledge base as we begin to build. Just like I did on YouTube, you know, I started building and then we just started talking about a lot of other things. Uh, but in, in the um, podcast, you know, because it's a new audience, some of you guys are going over there and I really appreciate it. Thank you guys so much for um, subscribing and, and supporting me. Uh, a lot of you guys are going over there, so you're already accustomed to me speaking on YouTube. You get to see my face. They don't see my face over there. But then over on the podcast, you know, that's a whole nother audience for those, you know, you guys are coming and then that's a whole nother audience. So I basically have to build a foundation. And so whatever is over on the podcast is not the exact same thing that's on the YouTube channel. So you guys make sure you go over there, make sure you like it, you know, and follow me so that you guys know whenever I upload. And for that, it takes a little, I found out it takes a little longer because I have a lot of editing that I have to do and putting music in the background and making sure that the microphone is not echoing in there. So for the podcast, it does take me a little longer to do because there's a lot of editing that goes along with that. And I do my own editing. Uh, and then on YouTube, you know, I can just do it, put the little thumbnail on there and post it. But over on podcast, it does take me a minute to edit everything. So, uh, you know, when I do one, it may take me a few days to edit because I can't sit and you know, in front of the computer and edit the whole time. So it takes me some time to edit. So I appreciate you guys, first of all, for suggesting it. And thank you guys so much for supporting me and doing it. And so as soon as I figure out the different echoes and how to drown out, you know, the echoes and get it just right, then I'll uh, work on toward uh, recording the book. So you guys will hear the book in Audible and that is at a fee. So you guys, thank you so much. Look up underneath the link in YouTube. I have a sponsored link, which is betterhelp.com backslash Dr. Carmen. Those of you that have asked me in reference to counselors in your area, you don't know where to look, you don't know what you're looking for, go on betterhelp.com backslash Dr. Carmen Bryant. And it's a nominal fee. It's a, it's a, uh, a small fee. It's a week free. From Miss uh, Arlene in Canada told me uh, you get a week free and especially if you tell them you know if you're having financial difficulties they give you a discounted fee as well and um, you can look for counselors that specialize in domestic violence trauma severe psychological abuse use that terminology you can ask them do you understand what narcissist abuse is do you understand what abuse by cluster b personality disorders are and see what they say and if you don't feel comfortable with them you can vet another counselor you know so you guys have that choice but some of you guys really do need counseling and not coaching you need mental health counseling because some of you are dealing with post-traumatic stress complex post-traumatic stress borderline personality disorder and so you guys are dealing with a lot Okay. And in my podcast, I actually talk about, you know, I broke it down. I broke down what um, pers the personality disorders are and what cluster A, B, and C personality disorders are. So go check that out. Okay. Thank you guys so much for your support. Thank you guys for, and make sure you order my book, go to Barnes and Noble or go to um, Amazon and order my book. It is unmasking. The, I had to go look at my book, unmasking the illusion of perfection. Let me see if I have one laying on the table. Okay, it's too far away for me now. I think I can reach over there. See if I can take you guys over here to get it. Oh, I'm all in the camera, aren't I? I apologize, y'all. <laughs> all in the camera. All in my nose. I am so sorry. Here goes the book. <laughs> here goes the book. It is unmasking the illusion of perfection. Now that you guys got to look up my nose, I'm not even going to edit that. You guys just have to keep that in there. And then we're family now. So you guys looked up my nose. I'm sorry. But here you go. It's Unmasking the Illusion of Perfection. This is my book. You guys go order it. It's on Amazon and Barnes and Noble. There's other bookstores too. Those are just the main ones that I know. It's under Westbow uh, Press as well if you want to order it from there. And you can get it Kindle or an ebook. Okay. So you guys have a wonderful evening. 
Thank you so much for your support. Thank you for your patience. And my apologies that I did not come on live. Thank you so much. And to all my moderators that support me and make sure you keep me on time. Though I cross over times and crash clocks and everything. You guys are so awesome. I thank you. And to my dear sweet um, TMG, thank you so much for keeping me updated on, uh, she keeps me updated on a lot of YouTube information as well. She is my sweetheart. And so is Miss Arlene from Canada. Thank you so much. You guys have a wonderful evening. Go be great.